Right then, let's go. Start casting our spell. A special spell. Do you really think we should be doing this here? No worries, man. Normal people can't see magic, see? Go on, Ollie boy. Cast Gateway. Um... Shunting, crybaby bunting. For the last time, it's Oliver! Hey, it's not bad work for a crybaby, this. Oh. Shall we? Huh? Hey, wait for me! <sighs> so this is... your world. Ah, home at last! But there's a tidy way to go yet. Hey, Mr. Drippy, that was pretty neat just now, huh? Oh, that herd of elk! Enjoy your first encounter with the majestic wildlife of our mysterious world, did you? Uh-huh. Jeepers. Oh, Nickers! Where did he spring from? Oh. Ah! What do we do? He's not like the big softies just now. He's itching for a fight. Proper savage. Let's run away. No, use that stick you got by there. Give him a whacking and send him packing. Oh. Oh. Ah! Look, Lively, he's making his move. Okay, so this is our first fight of the game. Now, um... Let's do it! Now, this, I understand that at the moment I don't have any spells. And this is barely the fight for com proper combat, so don't look at this like, Oh god, this is horrible. Because, basically, um, you know, this is basically the no any of the right combat. Okay, so don't look at this thing, I'll put, let, put you off and find the game. This is barely the combat. This is just kind of like a beginner's combat. I never do this, I never attack with my wand. You know. Uh, this is also just telling me about glims and stuff. You'll get the hang of it on the way. I mean, okay, if you got by this game, you can um, get it. Well, I can explain it in really quickly instead of reading that out for you. Basically, they'll drop gl glims, smaller gl then blue glims, and um, green glims. Green glims restore your health. Um, blue gl glims restore your magic points. The bigger the glims, the more health they'll restore. Well, hey, proper tidy. Nice one, Ollie boy. Jeepers, creepers. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention. Our world is absolutely riddled with beasties. But keep that up and you'll have nothing to worry about. Right, let's get a move on, shall we? Sure, Mr. Drippy. But where are we going? Well, first off, we need to get you a wand. But I already have a wand. <laughs> You're having a laugh, aren't you? That thing's about as magical as a flipping cabbage. You might just squeeze a gateway spell out of it, but you can forget about anything more than that. Honestly, I wish you'd think before you open your mouth. Oh, uh, sorry. Now, I told you Ding Dong Dell was just over by yonder, didn't I? Well, if we're very lucky, we might find a wand with a bit more oomph down by there. So, are wands really so hard to find here? Well, time was you couldn't move for the flipping things. But since Shadar showed up, magic's taken a real nosedive. He banned people from using it, see? 
cursed anyone who tried to. He scared them all so much they gave it up. So, he's pretty scary, huh? Well, he turned me into a flipping doll, didn't he? Just saying his name's enough to make most folks brick it. Still, I'd rather be a doll than have him go poking round in my heart. No one wants to be broken-hearted. Broken-hearted? Like, sad? Worse than that. Much worse. It's when he steals a piece of a person's heart. Poor beggars don't know whether they're alive or dead. That's no way to live, man. So that's why they're all so scared of him, huh? We can't let him go on doing this. Well, it's not a matter of letting him, is it? It's not like people flipping enjoy it. That's why I brought you here, innit? You might just be able to stop him, see? You really think I can? Of course you can! You are the pure-hearted one! And the legends say that the pure-hearted one will drive away the darkness! We'll teach you a few tasty spells and you'll be ready to face him in no time! Sound good to you? Okay, I'll do it. I'll learn magic. Of course you will! And that's why we need to find you a better wand! All right. Let's head for Ding Dong Dell. Tidy! Okay, so we're at last, like, really in the in the world. Now, if you notice, like, these um, loading screens, they're actually little symbols at the bottom that always change. Um, they're actually the shape of spells. But, you know, it's pretty interesting. I wouldn't have learned them all by now, and maybe never will learn some of them. I don't know if you actually have to learn all the spells in the game. But anyway, uh, isn't it beautiful, Ollie boy? Uh, it's good to be back. Okay, <laughs> you know, that's basically, again, thinking about the beasties around. Oh yeah, here, it's just a little something, consider it a gift from the Lord High Lord of the Fairies. Okay, free those bit. Uh, thanks, but what do I do with these? Just have a munch on one when you're feeling a bit ropey, and you'll be right as rain at no time, man. But a wizard cannot live by bread alone, honey boy. He's got one wand and all. And the prop that knobbly thing in your hand is for doing my flippin' heading. See that big castle to the north? That's Ding Dong Dell, that is. I reckon we'll find ourselves a one by there, so let's get moving, shall we? Okay. Yep, basically, these little gold things as well are, um, like, like, plants and stuff. Very nice, aren't they? Plants. Um, you know, it, it, this game is fun. This game's really fun as well, and the world is beautiful. So, yeah, this is really, this is the kind of the beginning part of the gameplay. By no means am I into the really the game yet. Oh, Nick, there's something I forgot to tell you. Well, what's that, Mr. Trippy? Okay. This is basically, again, something you, you, I can turn around like that in switch vibration on, but, yeah, okay, and, you know, this is basically just telling you more about controls, so I don't really want to read that, um, like, you know, about vibration and all that. So here's Ding Dong Dell. Looks to me like a classic case of broken-heartedness. Broken-heartedness? You mean that thing you were talking about before? That's right. The broken-hearted are people who've had part of their hearts stolen. Poor souls just uh, aren't themselves. Go all weird and uh, useless, they do. So his heart was broken uh, by... Keep up, will you? Shadar, innit? If anyone tries to stand up to him or does anything he doesn't like, he breaks their hearts into pieces so they can't put up a fight. Jeepers. But if he stays that way, we can't get into Ding Dong Dell. Then you better cure him, isn't it, Ollie boy? It's time to mend your first broken heart. Mend it, but how do I do that? Well, you can't do it just yet. There's a couple of things we'll, meet, we'll, we'll be needing first. But I know an old man who's just who's got just what we need. Proper useful, I am, eh? An old man? What old man? What do you mean, what old man? The old man, ain't it? Lives in the in a woods in the north of here. Proper deep and deeply dark it is. That's why they call it the deep dark wood. Makes sense, I guess. What's that? Alright then, here we go. 